There we are. Yep. Yep. So, I put together some wreath, um, not wreath kits, some bow kits for y'all. So we did what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Stick Jordan in a warehouse full of ribbon and possibilities are kind of endless. <laughs> John said he just refreshed Facebook and all of a sudden he found us. Yep, there you go. Hey, y'all. So we're going to go down the list. Uh, we already saw that um, WK-081 is sold out already, right? Is that yep. The so this one was a fall. So this is what I think we should do. I think you should make them by hand and then I should try to figure them out on the Easy Bow Maker. Like perfect. How to, like how to replicate your bow on the yeah, Easy Bow Maker. Perfect. Because so many people can't make your hand bows, but right. they all have the Easy Bow Maker. Right. So maybe if you do one, I'll watch. And then we'll do it on the Easy Bow Maker and see if we can tell you guys how to replicate it. Sounds good to me. Then you don't have to use the Easy Bow Maker. Yes. Y'all know, me and the Easy Bow Maker, we just do not get along for me. Actually, before I left to Crafters Convention, it came from my life. Oh. I, had, I had it on a shelf and it like fell off the shelf i was like that could have killed me it was like talk about me again <laughs> i was a little bit dramatic i was like could have killed me what's up y'all the text just came through i know don't tell the police but i did text at 904 and it said are you sure you want to send this during quiet time yes i'm sure it'll be fun i only texted the people who said they wanted live alerts oh okay so I chose this really pretty paisley ribbon. I re this one's a really nice fall combination. This paisley, this um, crisscross, and must uh, rust orange. Really love that. And then I have this four inch bow burlap, um, like a geometric pattern. But y'all know, look, look, this is really really pretty. I love it. It's got that all one. the fall colors in it. Okay, so we're gonna start off with our one and a half inch first. So he works backwards. It's okay, yes. we'll figure it out. I'm gonna make a tail. All right, let me zoom down on our, whoa, zoom, oh. you're good. Two 10 inch loops. So when he says 10 inch loop, y'all, it's literally pulling, pulling out 10 inches total, coming right. back, so it's a five inch. So if we were doing it on ours, it'd be a five inch loop. Right. Or um, 11 inch. So it's going to be four, so five and a half inch. One loop, then two loops on each side. So two and two. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We got this so far. And twist. I know it does get a little confusing when they're like, but I can't do it on the Easy Bow Maker. You can. You can. We're going to do it. I kind of give you all the measurements. Yeah. Joanne said it's only 7.06 at her house. I know. It's based off the time zone that I'm in. So if you were in California, could you still send it in? Yeah, so I could text at 8.59 in California to uh -huh. people on my list and... Mississippi and text them at 11 o'clock at night and not get in trouble. Oh, that's wild. Yeah. I didn't know that. You would think I would know that because I have the same thing. But... Yeah, y'all. So if you guys uh, missed when we first got here, so some people that have the new, the new, new page experience, they rolled out one last week. They rolled out a new one this week. The newest one is all messed up. And people are not getting the notifications. They're getting them, like, the next day. It's Yo, It's even happened to me. So this morning, yeah. I got one from one of our friends, Candy, that said Candy was live at, like, 7 o'clock in the morning. I was like, that was yesterday in the afternoon. Yeah. Even that happened to us, too. I was laying in bed, and it said, Deco Exchange is live right now. I was like... <laughs> we done did uh, that. Went home. I'm in bed. <laughs> 
So now I made two 12 inch loops um, using the one and a half inch ribbon. I think that looks really pretty. It's nice. Oh, so we're adding the one and a half inch back in again. Right. Yeah. Okay, okay. Sneaky. And then we're going to come in with our four inch. So of course I hold all of mine by hand. Um, I normally don't measure off the tails. And now this one's going to be at 13 inches, and I want four of the four inch. Julie, I saw your door hanger today, and it was so good. Parker's aunt Julie. Uh huh. Uh, we sent her some door hangers. Oh, you did. And she made them, and they were so good. So you're doing two or one? We're gonna do um, four. So that's, so that's two for me. So I need a total of four. Y'all are distracting me. I'm not focusing on class. Y'all, I have a whole box full of bows. From last time we did these, we had so many bows. I need to just put them on random things. Oh, because that's when we did the Pinterest live. Yeah. And not just one person made those. All of us <laughs> made those. Oh, that's the day that we told Tammy, like, two minutes and she talked yeah. for, like, 25. Yeah. So we're going to get my zip tie. I won't have a pipe. Lori, did you text me the word alert? Because I've only been texting people when I'm going live that texted the word alert. Happy birthday to Parker. Y'all, it's so funny. We all went out for Parker's birthday and he didn't come. Yeah. And it was good too. It was good. The first time I went there, it was not good. The, I guess because, okay, it was like my first week on this area, in this area, and I came from Texas. Like, I was oh, expecting, yeah, so like, like, fajitas, like, yeah. some good steak, and it was beef jerky. Ooh. And I was like, what is going on? Like, I can't eat this. I don't like, know. Abort mission, one star, do that. Like, I was used to papacitos. Like a good fajita so that's our first one. Okay, okay. I think that came out nice. I it did. The colors. You, nope. I was well, wondering if you put the little ribbon in the middle to no, hide your zip tie. Okay. So let's make it the right way, y'all. We'll need to go make it. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Why didn't Parker go with us? Well, he had to do his business call. I was right. like, well, we can just wait and hang out. And he's like, no, y'all just go without me. I don't want to go. So we went. Had a good time. Yeah. You never got your scissors? Donna, did you email customer service? All right, how long did you do your tail? I didn't measure my tail. Okay, so we're just gonna do a 12 inch tail. Give that a good pinch. Give it a good twist. Slide it right in there. No, even I'm gonna pay attention. How do you find us on Pinterest Live? We're not doing Pinterest Lives this month. But if you go to uh, Pinterest on your phone, there's a little TV in the top right or top left. Click on it. What about your loops? So these were a total of 13 inches. A total of 13. So seven, six and a half. Six and a half. Six and a half loops. Y'all, yeah. on your Easy Bow Maker, your, your loop is where you curve it back. So don't pull it out this way and do six and a half. That's going to come out short. On your loop this way, six and a half. Welcome back in Texas anytime. You know, Parker would like that, but I'm pretty sure we're gonna stay right here. He would probably like that because of water burger. You know, he's a water burger. Yeah. All right, so we're doing our four. 
Not yet. Well, how are we going to get you scissors if you didn't email customer service? Was this a long tail or a short tail? Uh, it's a short tail. I really like this one. So y'all, we're going to do about eight inches on that short side. Yeah, he does make a really nice hand. Now you went with your two and a half or your one? Nope, you had a little one and a half sneaky. Yep. The sneaky ribbon. All right. Sneaky ribbon is actually really pretty. I love the pasty prints. So on this one, it's just one loop on both sides right between your tails. All your tails go down. Mm -hmm. No, we don't have Whataburger in Louisiana. All right, this one you had four? So four, y'all, so if I was given these instructions, I would have said two, one, two, one. Because we only talked about half the bow. Okay, so, okay. I see that. Uh, your price was changed, was almost $290, but I told y'all I was going to hook you up in the 60919. Do we have an In-N-Out burger? No, we have real food here. I didn't like In-N-Out burger. It just goes In-N-Out. All right, then one loop on each side. You know, every food place Damon has ever taken, me or anybody on the team, has not failed. Y'all, you don't get this size and not have good food. That's true. All right, and I'm, of course, going to grab a pipe cleaner. Uh, the name of our business group, if you go to learnfromdamon.com, you can just scroll down. All right, we're going to slide this right off. What's the best place to eat here? Depends on what you want. Right. Like, if you're hungry for chicken, you gotta go to today's catch. You gotta go to the seafood place. Yeah, to get good chicken. If you want good breakfast, perish. perish. All right, y'all, then give it a good squeeze. Lunch is kind of all over the place for us. Yeah. And then just give it a little fluff out. So yours is definitely bigger. Yeah. I can tell. I didn't do a good job on the measurements. What's with all the angry faces? You. We not. We don't. Yo, I don't even see emojis. Boom. Yeah, so they're both about the same. So you know what I think the difference is? Turn them over. So on your hand bows, your bows get smaller as they come here, and then the easy bow maker doesn't really get smaller until it gets to the center. So uh, this looks okay. so much fuller. Yeah. See how much like closer these yeah. are together? I love how big that one Because on your hand bow, one. you're squeezing more of that ribbon together. Where on the easy bow maker, we were just worried about that tight pinch in the middle. However, they still look really good. You can still copy a Jordan bow. Yeah. Minor fluffy air. They can't even see the face you just made. All right. So that was WK-081. Yeah, so if you already got this kit, you're in luck. If you did not have it, it's sold out today. Yeah. Um, but that's what we would do with them. Boom. Next. Shelly Bailey says she loves today's catch. It is my favorite, and I love the people that work there. Um, it's yeah, just a good atmosphere. Treated us really, really nicely. Although, our favorite girl left. Really? Yeah. 
She now works at the grocery store. This one down the road? No. Oh. So this one's WK-082. It's a candy corn theme. No, you can't go wrong with candy corn for, for processing Christmas. For Halloween, <laughs> um, you can't go wrong with it. So I went off of this candy corn ribbon, which is absolutely the cutest. And I love that they put that black and white edge on it. Yeah. So I had one of these from somewhere else, and it was the exact same pattern, but it didn't have the black and white edge, and it was like... We don't like it floppy. Yeah. Rocky and Car... Now listen, I've only been to Rocky and Carlos once, and it reminded me of a bad Piccadilly, and I can't go back. Someone said angry face would be mad love. Uh, we don't listen. It's all engagement. Richard the kitty was in cuddle mode this afternoon, which was good. Um, it was storming earlier. Yeah. It was not in panther mode. So whenever you go to Rocky and Carlos, maybe we just had the wrong thing, but all the food is like pre-cooked, like if you were going to a family feast, and you look through this little window, and you're like, yeah, I'll take a slab of that chicken, and that side, like a Piccadilly. And I got, uh, I should have known better, I got chicken parmesan that had been sitting in that pan with the red sauce on it, so it was all soggy. soggy. Oh. Do I like today's catch over Desi's? Depends on who's in the kitchen. I was just going to say, it depends on who's in the kitchen. So, that's two different things that I would be hungry for. If I wanted a, a hamburger and a baked potato, um, or a good appetizer, I would go to Desi's. That's why I said, like, it all depends on what you're hungry for. Right. Like, cause all right. we've... So, we're doing the same recipe? Uh, a little bit. Okay. Okay. So that one only had three ribbons. This one has four. Yeah, this time you're doubling up on the yeah. one and a half. Right. I'm watching. So these are um, 11 inches. So these would be five and a half inch leaves. Yo, and that yellow ribbon was a spring ribbon. I was like, I need a yellow in there. Rocky and Cross is famous for macaroni and cheese. Mm. You gotta go to today's catch and have some yeah. real mac. Okay, I went there and I got the mac and cheese and they poured spaghetti sauce all over the top of mac no, and cheese. No, thank you. I was like, uh, what just happened to my spaghetti? No. The mac and cheese balls at Lotta Wada were really good. That was they good. Have, they have marinara. And they come with it. All right, so we did one, two, one. Right. So now we're going to bring in some more black and orange. And this one's going to be, well, a total of four, so it'll be two. So it'll be two, one, two, one. Okay, okay. like this black and orange gingham here. It's nice. You know how sometimes you get that black and or um mm -hmm. or any kind of gingham and it's like that thin feeling one. This one's not. Hey okay. Now I do not like the mac and cheese of Desi's. Y'all, it's just a spinach and artichoke dip with macaroni in it. It ain't right. Huh? Yeah. Oh, I don't know about that either. Are these ribbon kits? They are. 
Do you know what kit this one was? Oh, this one was uh, 82? It's WK-082. This was the one that had the most. So if you're really trying to get one, this one's your best chance. Yeah. Hey, Becky. Y'all, some of them only had, like, what? One had one. One had eight. Left. Yeah. And the sale is still happening today. So you can still spend $125 or more and get 20% oh. off your order with free shipping. No, no one likes to pay for shipping. I know I don't. Do you like paying for shipping? I don't ever pay for shipping. <laughs> Well, you're, you're when they're like, shipping Your warehouse is next door. <laughs> I call them, I'm like, uh, how much have I spent and not have to pay for shipping? What else do they have at today's catch? Seafood. Okay, next time you come over, we'll go to Desi's and you can order the mac and the award winning mac and cheese. It's award winning? Mm-hmm. Yeah, everyone around here has mac and cheese. Like, that's what they do. They have mac and cheese cook-offs. Oh. We need to make one of our workshops during this said cook-off. I don't know when it is. Oh, if you're definitely someone who makes stuff that's primitive... This is definitely the right to Nobody is talking about Cajun food because no one who really knows Cajun food goes out to eat to, and eats it. They don't cook it right. They cook Cajun food in restaurants for tourists. So it's very mild and... Yeah, it ain't right. Yeah. Like, so, we cook that at home. That's our bow. All right. So, 10... So 11s, 12, and then 13. Okay. <coughs> uh, this was kit 082, WK082. Yes. I think if you search candy ribbon, candy corn kit, mm -hmm. or candy ribbon kit. Or if you go to new arrivals, it's like they're all listed right there. All right. It's automatic, no coupon. You just have to get to the, the limit. And it's only on the website, not on the app. All right, so we're going to measure. This one is, like, thin, but the wire is still thick. Right. I like it. Six and a half. Hey, crafty. Frogs. You hear crickets and frogs. There's little baby bullfrogs outside. They were cute. Jordan's trying to give y'all a look, but you can't see it. Until I almost stepped on it. Well, he almost made him croak. And Kay, I do want to try that restaurant by you, the little big cup or whatever it is. You went there. No, we didn't. We did not uh, eat there. We had some restaurant down in the uh, in downtown. Some Mexican restaurant. It was really good. So y'all were we doing Zia's. Oh, Zia's is good. That's where me and Parker met the first time, was at Leah's. Really? Mm-hmm. In Lafayette, where you went? It was really good. All right, we're going to do ours a little bit different. I need tails at the top. I have one tail at the top. Your sermon man told you that baby if are you in Florida? Because those are different kind of frogs. Hey, we're gonna do another tail at the top because I need some bangs. You need some big Texas hair up there? Yeah. You know Texas women and their hair. It's bigger the hair. So the first kit that we did, that one already sold out. That was yeah. WK-081. It was the fall kit. It did sell out already. Then we did this one with four. Mm -hmm. Oh, you like Steamboat. They have a Steamboat Bills in Lafayette? I did not know that. I thought Steamboat Bills was in, like, was in Lake Charles, and then they had one in uh, 
De Ritter or De Quincey or something. Oh, Project? Marilyn, did you uh, watch the video that was in the uh, the box with your bow maker? It should have like a QR code to tell you how to assemble it. All right, so we did our four. Now you did two. Mm -hmm. You have to literally hammer those pegs in. I don't know if you can see mine or not, but you can see where they're smashed from the hammer. Your scissors are tight. They shouldn't be. But it does look like this is a screw. You may be able to unscrew it a little bit. I don't know. I've never... I'm, I've never had that problem. Mm -hmm. And I have have a lot. I have six here. I have 12 over there. You have six there, and next week when we're all here together, there's going to be one. Yeah, you have to look up each skew. You know, if you go to the Deco Exchange page, you click on there, you click on Products, click on new arrivals they're trying to figure out what's in the boxes though because we don't have the images yet oh that was my fault y'all no, sorry i didn't get pictures all right we're gonna tie this off it's a surprise yeah what's the little peg for i always say it's just for conversation uh some people use it to make hair bows Give it a good twist. Someone said WD-40. I would be scared that would get on my ribbon. Yeah, and that's going to stain your ribbon. Like, mm -hmm. Alright, so we followed Jordan's recipe, kinda. Except I brought some of my tails up to the top. I guess I should dovetail. That would be nice. Uh, there will be photos. Potentially tomorrow. We'll probably do a photo of like the finished bow with the ribbon. Oh, well, let's dovetail real quick. Because this one's a little long. The extra inch wasn't needed. Hey, hey. That extra goes a long way, friend. Uh, Kathy, we haven't even got 60919 in for the season yet. So y'all, we follow the same formula, uh, two, one, two, one. Um, I just brought some of my ribbons up to the top to give it more of a circle shape, and his is more like a traditional bow. Right. Janice, I cannot hear you. I can see you, but I cannot hear you. That's WK-082. My bow just bit the dust. It went off the table. Oh. Let's see, which one was next? This one was a fun one. This one was a Halloween one. Ooh, Halloween's not favorite. Halloween one. WK-085. It's very green. Yeah. <laughs> Get your own pair. It's not like you don't have 20 pairs in that little bucket. But I'm telling you, y'all, every time we get together, that bucket on Wednesday is full. And by like Friday, when we all need it, we're like, where are the scissors? I'm prepared. Tammy's gonna take some of those probably. I'm convinced she's the one. They wanna this. know uh, how do you do Jordan's half bow? How do I do my half bow? Maybe they're, they want to do the half bow on the easy bow maker. Okay. Let's see, what do I have? We'll 
We'll do the half bone the next one. Okay. So we're doing the same formula, so it's four ribbons. Or are you swapping it up on me? I'll swap it up on you. So two ten for eleven. Hey Celeste. I don't even have the small one in here, so... It fell somewhere, and I picked it up, and I tried to put it back in, and it just... It didn't work. I have it in two of them, not in the third one. So I definitely like using this kind of bow, because it's, um... I like to use this for, like, gifts and gift packages. Scissors are amazing. They're my favorite. I lost mine again. How do you lose scissors? I, I you need to like Tammy and glue everything to your table. And I don't. You know what I'm kids. getting for Christmas, y'all? You know when you go to the bank and that ink pen has that little chain on it. <laughs> he can put a sticky mount square on his table, and then chain the scissors. <clears throat> Hey, Melly Mel. Put E6000. Y'all, I have used and put together a lot of easy bows and you don't have to glue them you just have to use a hammer just literally just follow the instructions i wasn't paying attention okay so we have one now we have a half. Okay. Half, half, two, one. You got this. I got this. <laughs> Don't overcomplicate it. Donna, if you can <clears throat> literally go to Google and type in rotary cutter, millions will pop up. Uh, I've had those for a while. Yeah, ours are out of stock right now, but literally they're all the same. You just have to determine what shape you want. Uh, some of them are long. That and I like this kind, personally. I like the ones that have a grip that you squeeze it. I don't like the the ones that are just like a stick with the round. Oh they're, yeah, they're kind of wobbly. Like I like to be able to grip it and go. But there's literally. 10 or 15 different styles that I can think of. Like, you're just gonna have to go to the store and test them out, see which one you like. I like that style as well. All right, so we're doing a half. Yep. Well, the, the white glue gun, I think we have like a thousand on the way, along with rotary cutters. Um, Stephanie Sanders is watching us in the How to Make Grease Facebook group and not here. So, Stephanie, if you can hear me, 
if you look at it, it probably says that we're live in how to make wreaths. We, Betty, we haven't done a half bow yet, so we can't show you. In the next box, we're going to do the half bow. Are you asking about what made this a half? We're only doing half of it. Right? So on the other ones, we did one loop, one loop. This time we're doing one loop. That's it. If you're asking about the official half bow, we haven't done that one yet. Yeah. Right? So look, we only did half of it. Now on this one, we're going to do two. So two on each side. Mel, where you been? Like, there's a lot next door. Bring your shopping cart. Bring an extra suitcase. We just shipped all kind of stuff to Mel for her crafting event, I think. Uh, Tonga says she tried a half bow and didn't turn her ribbons around. Uh oh. What in the ribbon is going on there? Why don't you put a thinner loop? Because normally by the time I've already added this in my wreath, so on my wreaths, I like to glue like a piece of greenery yeah. that I use on there because it all it makes it all look cohesive. Aaron is in charge of checking it in. Aaron. I don't know where that pipe banner came from. Uh, we did not retail therapy. We did taco therapy. I had enchiladas. Delicious. All right. Y'all, this pipe cleaner. You know what it did? It came out of a kit. Oh. And when they put them in the kit, they make them fit in like a one by two bag for some reason. Get it together, Rocco. Get it together. All right. Y'all, push it down. Give it a good pinch. Megan, are you new here? Are you new here? Get it together. So I like using this kind of bow. Um, Especially like on gift packages or gift baskets that I have to do for a holiday. Yeah. Whatever. Well, I don't know, Mel. Alright. Do, uh, do you want me to hold off till next week to have the face catch? I mean, we'll probably have it twice before she gets it. <laughs> yeah. Yo, I was laying in bed last night and I was like, Really we right just now. left a Mexican restaurant. <laughs> I know, but that was last night. I fell asleep during your coach vlog. How do you stay on your diet at Taco Bell? I just eat whatever I want. Anytime. Yeah, I'm not on a diet, so... I just don't drink Cokes. Alright. Yours is more airy than mine. I bet you made your loops a little bit bigger or something. Boom. Nailed it. That was a Halloween selection. What we kit was that? Uh, WK-085. 085? Mm-hmm. Just pile of bottle boxes right there. That means we've done 85 wreath kits this year. We're kind of slacking. I think we go up to like 90 already with these. Uh, Veronica, they sent us some new red handed scissors, 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 no, wire cutters to test, and they were not good. I rejected all the samples. These aren't them, these are the regular ones. But they had some kind of like coating on them, and the first stem I 
did the coating crack. Oh. I was like, what in the redneck is going on here? <laughs> Never Denied. <laughs> so on this one, I want to measure out my tail. So I'm going to start off with eight inches. Eight inches. About so ten. four. Wait a minute. Your two loops are two different sizes? All my loops are different sizes. On the same ribbon? This is the half bow. I don't, no, I don't, I never made it happen. Okay, so we've got a four inch loop and a five inch. No, he's not doing a loop, he just cut it. Oh, I thought you were making, look, I thought you were doing another loop. I no. was like, you're like, uh, you, what, what kind of loop <laughs> is going like, on here? No. It's like we're doing a four inch loop, then a five inch loop, and the same ribbon on the same row? Mary, you need to cut out Mountain Doodle Lose 50 pounds, if that's what works for you. Like, I, so I had no intentions of ever really cutting out Cokes. I just did it that day, yeah. and I was like, I'm going to stop drinking Cokes, see if I can do it. And lo and behold, I've been able to do it. Yo, this is a funky bow. This is not a funky bow. It is not. I refuse to believe that it's a funky bow because it's not. Because on the funky bow, you switch the ribbons. You switch the loops. So one loop goes this way, then you do the next loop, and then you do another one. It's not the same. This all points down in one direction. It's not the same. We definitely got this one under control on the Easy Man right there. I can all go the same direction. You can't mess this one up. Oh, if you have a cat, you definitely need a cat wheel. It's the funniest thing. It's just not, it's a funky bow. It is not a funky bow. It is not. I'll argue with the, I'll argue with you this. Okay, so let's not make a funky bow. Yeah, thank you. Even Tammy's like, it's not a funky bow. Tammy said that? that no, Tammy said it is a funky bow. I was going to say, we Because can't. she does the funky bow, and her funky bow is different. And I'm so glad that that picks up the word funky, not something else. Okay, so we are not going to make a funky bow. We're just going to make a quick loop. With the tail. What size was your loops? So you weren't paying attention. That's okay. So just get a 10, little bit 11, smaller 12. on every loop. 10, 11, 12. So what do you do with a funky bow? With a half bow? I actually use it in my wreaths. Like sometimes there's more ribbon than yeah. this. Um, but I started doing that because I was able to use some of my designer ribbons. Right. That are more costly, which you know, like. $50, $60 rolls of ribbons, $100 roll of ribbons. I can get... We got the prettiest $105 roll of ribbon today. From where? The one that we saw at, from uh, Nancy. Oh, I was like, from where? I was like, wait, but there's some, there's a $105 roll of ribbon on that shelf over there? Oh. See, so someone says, Funky Bow, you switch tails up and down. And I don't do that one. OneFastCat.com, that's right. Listen, we got it on sale, okay? Don't judge us. And it doesn't even have a wire in it. Oh yeah, it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't have a wire in it. Nancy Brown. <laughs> it's Nancy Brown's fault. She had a sale. 
She did. It was a really good sale, too. I didn't pay $105 for it. Have you seen that TikTok bottle link? That's something you see from a distance. Yep, that's me when that's $105. And it's not on sale. Y'all, I remember going to the Christmas store in New Orleans when I bought, like, my first $19 roll of ribbon, and I thought it was so big. I actually remember when I bought my first roll of deco mesh ribbon from Trendy Tree and it was like $13 I bought croaked over. I was like, oh, God, $13. Okay, this is the unfunkiest funky bow. Why does yours look different? Oh, because I didn't do that little kick up right there. But so on the half, I call it the half bow. If you want to call it the funky bow, you can. It's not the funky bow. So, but this allowed me to use those high-end designer ribbons without, um, like, breaking the bank. This is the same bow that I use on my Christmas trees. So, it's a half bow. I use the half bow on Christmas trees. Thank you. But, y'all, look at that color combination. That navy blue with that orange. And those leaves are um, metallic. Donna, it's just a Facebook thing. We can't. I also texted everyone that's in our live alert. So if you don't, if you didn't sign up for those, maybe why you didn't get them. Yeah. Do we still have gin? Girl, we don't, I don't drink. Do you still have a gin? Charlotte, I need more words. If we had gin, it's probably gone. With my workers? <laughs> Look, Christina was over there talking about my page. Sorry. Yeah, Well, I made my tails longer because it's pretty ribbon. This is pretty ribbon. I think this was in... I think the cute? half bow would be cute on a door hanger. Did y'all already reveal the pop of the monthly lots? Yes. Yes, okay. I'm like whispering like if they can't hear me. Y'all, that one was in the monthly box. Mel chose that one. Okay, okay. You want my half bow or your half bow? It doesn't matter. <laughs> Probably yours. Y'all, it doesn't really match, but we just want to see. I think the half bow would look good on a door hanger. Yeah. Do you sell that box with ribbon and bows? No, you have to make your own bows, girl. Yeah. We sell the ribbon, just not the bows. So the next one I really, really enjoyed. Um, I was strolling through the warehouse. Y'all, it was hotter than you know what today in that warehouse. And I'm over there trying to make these ribbon boxes. And I pass by and I see this ribbon on the very bottom shelf. And I'm like, oh, I like that. Y'all, look water. how pretty that is. A little water? Yes, please. I know we didn't bring even bring any drink. We came straight from the restaurant. We just had salty chips and queso. Let's go do a live. Yeah. This one's WK-088. And I kind of went with um like a natural elegance kind of theme. Burlaps and golds and um, there's some snowflakes. The sale runs out in one hour. Yeah. I didn't even get to shop yet. But this ribbon has a gold um, bling edge on it. Jordan, what is the ribbon that you designed? Well, I 
designed all the boxes. I think I'm talking about the ribbon that you actually designed and went to market. That one. I designed that one in red and white, green and light, uh, lime green and red, and then there's a blue and red, and there's a pink and red. Regina, did you get the turkey door hanger? Isn't it freaking cute? <coughs> Jacqueline, he didn't make these boxes till this afternoon. Yeah. And look, I told him last night. I said, hey, they were asking for bow boxes and they didn't do it till this afternoon. Not my fault. Last drink. You can't find the gingerbread man. Oh no, which one? So that's one that I designed at when we went to market. Absolutely love that one. I'm just gonna leave it out here. You wanna wait till it goes back in? See? Just leave it out, Parker. He'll put it up. Lori, are you all rest up from uh, your travels? So, I mean, it's hot outside, but it's not hot until you go into my warehouse down the street. Oh. It's like a convection oven. Y'all, I smelled bacon the other day. I was like... It was Jordan. It's me. <laughs> it is terrible. The one that goes on a wreath? Yeah, I kind of figured that, but... Which one are you looking for? Because we have lots of different gingerbread items. Did somebody really just say one? <laughs> yeah. They did not. Megan, come get your people. <laughs> the turkey is awesome. It really is. Yo, that turkey is cute, but do you want to know what I think is cuter? Is the Frankenstein. With the bubble gum? Yes. <laughs> and... If you bought the blue and cream pumpkin. Mom keeps telling me there's a ribbon that matches it, but no one has showed me it yet. Like there's a metal gingerbread man, there's a stuffed gingerbread man, there's a gingerbread girl. Hmm. Can you ask why the warehouse is not air conditioned? Uh, it's just not. It would, we got a quote on the other one, and it was like $85,000 to air condition it. And I was like, y'all gonna sweat, sorry. This ribbon's pretty. Yeah. And it's, I mean, if it was, if I had purchased the warehouse, I may be willing to spend $85,000 to improve it, but it's, I'm just running it. I can't. Yeah, that's hard to justify that much, especially if it's not mm -mm. yours. That's like an extra 29000 a year on that building. Not happening. You're having a hard time finding a mesh wire that is more open mesh looking for a wide roll. I don't know what that means. Cindy, you don't have to do anything. You just go to uh, decoexchange.com. If you get to over $125, it'll automatically add the coupon. So we run a sweatshop. No one actually works in that warehouse. Um, they do have to check inventory in every once in a while, but no one works there the two areas that people work in we did have acs installed this is a very blingy ribbon yeah i like this one you know i'm all about that bling
<laughs> Melissa, we did send out a text. I see what they're doing though. They're they're starting to pay attention to some of the wreath designers. Cause I there's a company that makes this. Oh yeah, um, Emily watches. Emily, if you're watching, you need to say hello. Emily, I know you're watching. Did you see us? We see you. <laughs> Emily says, I watch all the time and I don't say anything. Rude. I know. I mean... Okay, Emily made me some fried rice. It had pineapples in it. And it was so good. Did she cook for you? Uh, no. Oh, she only cooks for people she likes. I'm just saying. Well, I never got to meet Emily. Well, that's your problem. I thought I was going to be able to go this year, but you like, like, no, swiper, no swiping, I'm going. Um, it was, okay, we were cracking up because we were at the table and Emily's like, I'm going to make you some fried rice. I'm like, okay. And Parker's like, do I get some? She's like, no. Poor Parker. I mean, she made enough for all of us and she brought balls down, but she was like, I only cook people I like. And the other people that were working, it was just for me and her. She was joking, y'all, but... Oh, this one's pretty. I like this look. Yo, if you you buy this one, this is... WK-088, um, and you take out that snowflake ribbon, you'll have a really pretty fall um, color scheme as well. There's some creams and yeah. whites and gold. That's really popular for fall. It's like very blingy. Yeah. Okay. This one, this one's pretty. It's very pretty. Okay, so it was two, one, two, one. Oh, the original recipe? It's one, two. With like KFC. One, two. One, two, one, two. Yeah, like the very first one that we did. Really? I can't remember. And I'm the one in class. They want to know what the wreath kit number was? Uh, WK-088. Okay. 11, 12, 13, 14. Since we already did this recipe, I'm just going to do my own thing. Starting with this on the bottom because it's my least favorite. But this one was on the bottom. That's how you did it. So you're not supposed to alter the recipe. Okay. Nice to see y'all too. All right, so we're going to go about six and a half on the bottom loop. Y'all, there's also a potential that uh, it just didn't text some people, depending on where you're at. Did anyone on the East Coast get the text message? I'm wondering if, uh, like, Kathleen Jack got like it. even though I told it to text, if it was like, no, not today, friend. We're going to put this one next. So I want to separate the bling a little bit. What's the skew on the turkey door hanger? I, listen, if you just type in turkey door hanger, it does show up. Um, but I think it's PCD-W-019, but it could be 14 and I could be lying to you. But I'm pretty sure, because people were just searching for turkey door hanger on the website, so I went and added that into the description. The Roger turkey, got the text? Okay. I don't know. Turkey door hanger is really cute. I don't, have a, I don't have a good explanation on the text. Right now. I had a request earlier. I don't know if you're referring to me. I want a Santa face. I think I already have one. Like old Santa face. The vintage Santa? Yeah. Just his face or just like his head on something? His head. Like on that wreath slime that I used today? Okay. I already had that. 
You're in Utah and didn't get it. Megan's probably not signed up for all those. So I'm not probably not. Answer. I had to sign her up for my Iowa to Crafters Convention. Wow. Yeah. Best friend. That's supposed to be your best friend. I know. Wow. Maybe only the East Coast got it, because it sounds like everyone else didn't get it. We ever do uh, critiques? We do in our membership. Jordan does them once a month. Yep. That'll be next Tuesday. All right. Give it a good squeeze. I just use what I normally do, same ribbons. Great. If you took out the snowflake, you can all you also have a really pretty wedding ribbon. This ribbon's thick. You know what it reminds me of when you touch it? Someone's cast. Did you help the cast? You never touched the cast? No, not really. Why? Did not follow the recipe. Yours is more blingy for sure. Yeah. I kind of toned down the bling because the bling is not really my thing. Uh, by putting it lower in the bow. So look at just by switching that one ribbon at how different these two bows came out. So this one is at the top and you can see it's real sparkly on camera. Just kind of move it like this a little bit, there you go. I decided to put my more solid burlap towards the top to kind of tone it down a little bit. Oh look, it was PCDW14. That's how many times you printed that, <laughs> that one anger. I know a lot of my skis. Christine Jerry, I got you in the hauntedest haunted house I could find. Abort mission, one star, two hour. Y'all, if you guys don't know, all of the coaches are coming here next week. We are doing a virtual summit. It's going to be super fun. Um, you can go to makersvirtualsummit.com to check it out and learn all about it. If you land on the Michaels website, y'all, we did the Michaels Virtual Summit like two years ago. It's not the same thing. You cannot join the Michaels Zoom call. Um, it's going to tell you that it's most beautiful. So when you get there, it should definitely say Makers University across the top. And uh, let me show them the other, re the okay. other bow kit. Yeah. But, um, Jordan's going to make more bows tomorrow. Yes. But tonight... Show y'all the color combination so that way you know for if you're purchasing them. Because if you want to get that discount code, you want to get that discount. That runs out in 40 minutes. So this one is WK 086. It is a Halloween one. Black and orange. I like that one. And the, this one isn't, it's um, like a charcoal gray ribbon. It's so pretty. I don't know yeah. how that hasn't sold out. I know. It's been I, here for a I long time. I saw it on the shelf. I was like, oh. I, was like, I had to double check one. to make sure it was listed. Yeah. So this is WK-086. Uh, 
WK-087 is a Christmas one, and my favorite color combination, red and lime green. This one is so pretty too. I use it at night. Yeah. I love this one right here, the yeah. ornament one. Definitely, it screams vintage to me because of those ornaments. Then you add in that star ribbon, and then that check ribbon. There's those two. Um, Y'all, I like all of these, but. You did so many wrong. I did. This one's WK-080. And I definitely got inspired by the vintage colors. So I chose oh, that. That's pretty blue and the red with the snowflakes. That's why he wants a Santa Claus face. Yeah. I see what you did. That one. That one's WK-080. And I'm showing y'all because we don't have the pictures on the website. But that way you can kind of come back and see these. This one was another one of my favorites. Um, a fall fall box with the rust orange, the dark brown, the burgundy, and the moss um, green color. This one's uh, a mystery. Yeah, let's see what I'm going to say closely. Y'all, and if you want that discount, it expires on what? 48 minutes. This one is WK083. I feel like we wrote that a while ago. So that's WK... There's only one of those available. Yeah. Only one? Only one. How many did you list? I don't know. There's only one. So there's only one, y'all. WK-083. All... And then I have one more Halloween one. I did do quite a bit of Halloween. This one's WK-084. And this has our traditional Halloween. And I really, really love this four inch Halloween ribbon. It's black, purple, and orange. Black, purple, and orange stripe with a Harlequin. Oh, that's very pretty. Yeah. All right, y'all, that's it for tonight. Jordan will be live with y'all tomorrow. At 11 a.m. At 11 a.m. on YouTube. Yep. And 2 o'clock back here on Facebook. Yep. Uh, to finish making some of these bows. Yep. And who knows what else. Did you master the Jordan 3.0? No. Did you see it? I saw some of it. I didn't. Um, you weren't impressed? I kind of like it, but I didn't like the first part that I did. The second uh, okay. part that I did, I liked. So. It's only the ending that matters. Well, I gotta figure it out first. Oh, damn it. oh he's getting off this camera. See what he does to me.